Hello friends, welcome back. This is Manish Pandey. Today in this video, I am going to show you how to get queue names from current environment. So environment means your running environment. It means it can be a development environment or UAT environment or production environment. So based on the environment, you can get all the queue names in Blue Prism. I'm going to show you how to do that. So let me take this a start here. Delete this link. We need to take action stage. Double click on that. Select business object work queues. Select get queue names from this action. And there is no input required here because automatically it will take all the queue names from the current environment. Now in the output we'll get the collection and we can store this in the queue names collection and it will give you all the queue names. Now click OK and what are the queue names we'll get here? Let me show you. So based on the env environment you will see all those queue names here. In this queue you can see queue management. So currently we are getting two queue names and these two queues we can get in our collection. We can see that. Now let's link here and let's link this with the end. And we are ready to run. Right click set next stage. Step over. Step over. And you can see here in the collection we have two queue names. In the current value you can see we have two queue names available here. First Centrix data solutions underscore queue and second queue is Q2. Right? So there is no condition, it will just give you all the queue names that is paused or running. So I hope this is useful. If so, please like this video and please subscribe this channel. Thank you so much for watching this video. If you want to learn UI Path RPA, then you can visit my YouTube channel youtube.com slash UI Path RPA. If you want to learn Blue Prism from Udemy, so I have created one course for Blue Prism RPA complete course on Udemy. So you can go there and you can purchase that course and you can get the certificate from there. I will enter the, the referral code and the link in the video description. You can go through that. I hope you like that one. Thank you so much for watching this video.